Hi friends, it's Miss Carla. Today we're going to work on our fine motor skills and we're going to make cereal caterpillars. So as you can see, you can use Cheerios or you can use Apple Jacks or Fruit Loops or whatever kind of cereal that has a hole in the middle. And today, my son and daughter are going to help us make cereal caterpillars. This is Logan and this is Devin and they're going to make their own cereal caterpillars. So what you need is a pipe cleaner and you need glue because you're going to have to put eyes on them and you can have scissors, a hole punch. If you don't have any pipe cleaners, you can use a string. So what you can do if you use a string is tie a Cheerio or a Fruit Loop or Apple Jack at the bottom and then at the top put a piece of tape that will make it easier to string. So I'm going to use the string and Devin and Logan are going to use the pipe cleaners and we're going to make cereal caterpillars. So when you're using your pipe cleaner, the first thing you want to do, you want to show them Logan and Devin is put one of your cereals at the bottom and you're going to curl the pipe cleaner around so that the cereal will stay on. Okay? Just like that. Okay? Let's go. I'm using Cheerios, Logan is using Cheerios, and Devin is using Apple Jacks. So you can make your caterpillar however long or short that you want. It's not a race. Take your time and make sure that you're stringing them and pulling them all the way down to the bottom so that they're all down there, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make our cereal caterpillars. And I hope that everyone has had a lot of fun at home seeing all of your teacher's videos with all the caterpillars. They've been growing a lot and they're starting to go on the top of their little cups and they're starting to hang in their chrysalises and make the J shape. And then as they harden, we'll put them into our butterfly nets and we'll wait for them to become butterflies. So I'm just gonna put a few more on. And the fun thing about making cereal caterpillars is while you're making them, you can eat them too. Make sure you wash your hands first, okay? It's very, very important. We've all washed our hands before we sat down at the table to make ours. So keep stringing them. If you want to, you can mix it up and you can put different cereal on there. Let's take a couple from Devin. <laughs> Move them on down. It's your caterpillar, so you can make it however you want. If you want to make a pattern, you can or if you just want to put them on. However, that is okay too. So I'm going to put a few more on. Devin and Logan, how's it going? I'm finished. You're finished, okay. So Devin, why don't you go ahead and show them how you're going to finish yours. All right, I have a little pipe cleaner left, so I'm going to cut off at the top. Leave enough so that I can also curl it down like we did at the beginning. And then secure them. So friends, after you've made your pipe cleaner or your string with your caterpillar, you can put eyes on it if you want to. So what we're doing is we're using hole punches and using little colored pieces of card. And you can make, Devin's got like a star hole punch. Logan has a circle. Did you finish yours up, Logan? Oh yeah. You can use pom-poms, you can use if you want to color on them, it's completely up to you. They are your caterpillars. So after you're done with your pipe cleaner, you can go ahead and twirl your pipe cleaner at the end so your cereal doesn't come off. Then go ahead and put your eyes on. If you're doing the string, you're going to kind of want to do the same thing that you did at the beginning and move it down. Move your cereal down here. So, and you can kind of take it and make a loop. Mom or dad might have to help you with this one. Kind of make a loop so your cereal doesn't come out. 
So I'm going to go backwards with it, just like that. Okay. And then, like, Mom and Dad will have to help you with this. And take, you can tie a knot at the end. Okay. And then have Mom or Dad take a pair of scissors and cut off the excess. Okay. So I chose to do green eyes. So I'm going to do, Devin, can you pass me the glue, please? Thank you. I'm going to make green eyes on the end of my caterpillar. Okay, so make sure you let the glue dry first on all of your caterpillars. Devin, Logan, you want to put yours out there? And then what you can do is you can save them and then maybe on a nice sunny day because it's supposed to rain. So I would wait until the rain is gone, but you can go and you can put them out in your tree and you can see if any birds will come by and eat your cereal off your caterpillar. Thanks for showing with us today. We'll see you later. Bye, friends.